Hey guys, it's Lexi. Alright, so I just got out the shower. Um, I used a couple things in my hair that I'll put in the description box. But I also have a little bit of coconut oil in my hair. I just put it on my scalp and throw out my hair just a little bit after I get the out the shower. I always do that. So I kept that the same. But I'm going to be starting doing my twist out. Um, my hair has been out of the t-shirt or towel or whatever for about 15 minutes. So it's a little bit dry. But it's still damp enough to do a decent twist out, I hope. So we're going to begin. So as you know, the only product I'm going to be using is Eco Styler Gel. I use the, I'm going to use the olive oil one because I feel like maybe that will add some moisture. The thing I'm most afraid about is that it's going to be dry. Um, so we'll see about that. But now I'm just going to start by parting my hair. I'm not even going to use a comb. I probably should, but I'm not going to. So I'm going to now split it down the middle. And then I'm going to take a section probably like an inch thick and go from here down to my ear. All right, and just kind of a warning, I didn't watch any videos or anything about how to do this. So I'm kind of winging it, but I feel like I should be fine. All right, so I'm just taking, I don't know how much to use this much. I'm gonna smooth, oh, that feels bad. I'm going to smooth it into my hair first, and then do a flat twist. Also, when I do twist up, I usually do like a braid at the end. But that makes the like curl pattern inconsistent, so I'm going to try to do a regular twist and see if it actually stays in. I'm going to use a little bit extra for my ends to maybe keep those locked. I don't know. I'm really scared for this, honestly. If you can't tell. Alright, and I'm just curling the end. Let's see if that stays. It actually is staying. Anyways, ew, it feels sticky too. Okay, now I'm gonna do my next section. I'm just gonna like split this one. So ideally I'm gonna have three on each side. Okay, so I just finished all three. This is what they look like. I'm surprised that the ends are actually staying. It's probably because I put a lot of gel at the bottom. I'm kind of scared, um, I'm, but I'm going to do the other side off camera, and these are what these ones look like so far. Don't judge the parting. I don't know what it looks like, and I'm scared. All right, I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, so I just finished this side. This is what it looks like. I feel like this side might look a little better. Maybe not. I don't know, but I'm going to put a scarf on and sleep with it so right now it's two o'clock on tuesday i might leave it until thursday because i'm not going to school anyways or i might take it out tomorrow but i'll let you know and yeah actually 
feeling kind of better about this. I was really scared at first. It still feels weird. It's just not what I'm used to. And I'll check in when I'm done. Hey guys, so now that I'm taking my hair out, it's Thursday at around 4 p.m. This is what the twists are looking like. Pretty frizzy, but overall they look pretty more nice and moisturized. To take them out, I'm using one of my favorite oils, which is this grapeseed oil that I just got from Beauty Supply. Um, it was only a couple of dollars. And then I'm just putting a little bit of that into my hand and smoothing it out on my hair before I take the twist down. So taking the twist downs are pretty self-explanatory. Um, the only thing that I should mention is that I'm trying to be super delicate with handling the curls, making sure not to rip them apart or anything. And yeah, that's it. So based on the first twist alone, I was pretty impressed by the definition I got. You can tell definitely by this clip, looking at the ends, you can just see how defined the curls at the bottom were. Um, but the only thing that was kind of disappointing was the length of my hair. I thought it shrunk up a lot, but I guess that was just due to the fact that it was pretty wet when I did it. Overall, I say definition is fire. <laughs> All right, once again, I'm adding just a little bit of grapeseed oil in and rubbing that throughout my hair, fluffing it out a bit, parting it a couple different ways, and that is the video for you guys. Thanks for watching.